Hey, good morning. Hope everyone's having a great day so far. It is Thursday. I cannot believe it's Thursday already. It's uh, almost the weekend. So quick thing here. Uh, let's take a stroll back to memory lane from a couple years ago when COVID hit. Um, and when they started dropping the Fed, meaning they started dropping the rates all the way down to zero, we got absolutely hammered in the mortgage industry from you know clients and from people who were uh, you know, basically, you know, trying to buy a house or, or, or trying to refinance and so forth uh, because everybody thought the rates went down to zero, okay? And it, it's something where it, it's frustrating, but I see where that comes from because from, from the newscasters just, you know, sp you know, just talking about it and not really explaining it and so forth. So, Two years ago, when the Fed dropped down to zero, mortgage rates didn't go to zero, okay? So the, when the Fed adjusts the short-term rate, like they did yesterday, bringing it up a quarter percent, uh, that affects lending between banks, okay? And the offshoot of that is rates for short-term uh, for short-term type of loans start going up. Um, so basically, you know, car loans, HELOCs, you know, credit cards and so forth, those will go up, okay? So... But for mortgages, that in it, you know, by itself doesn't increase mortgage rates, okay? Um, because it's got nothing really to, to, to really do with it. What really, you know, right now is increasing uh, rates going up is quantitative tightening, not easing, tightening. So what they did two years ago was the easing part, uh, basically just gobble up trillions of dollars of mortgage-backed securities, uh, you know, just trying to keep everything going. Uh, but eventually, that has to be uh, paid for. And so that's a whole nother thing, what's gonna happen to the dollar, but that's besides the point. So when they did that two years ago, kept rates low. So now when they're tightening, they're trying to get these mortgage-backed securities off their balance sheet, okay? Which you're gonna have to do. And that in itself, that's why rates have been going up, okay? Among other factors, okay? But don't get the two confused. So when the Fed says that they're raising rates, it's on the short-term rates. It's from bank to bank lending. It's got nothing to do with long-term interest rates. When they say quantitative tightening, that's what's pushing up interest rates right now. So we're trying to get this word out, trying to get ahead of it right now. Uh, so everybody's on the same page, but rates are, you know, rates have been going up every single day because, because they've been tightening uh, instead of, you know, gobbling up all these MBS mortgage-backed securities. So hopefully that makes sense. I know I've talked about it. I've talked about it, talked about it. I'm just trying to get it out. Uh, so if you can, uh, you know, share this or talk to other people about it, that will really help people understand how, how that works on that part. So uh, if you got any questions, comment down below. Uh, shoot me a private message or text me at 423-262-9229. And have a great rest of your day. Talk to you soon.